Here we go, all you football nerds. This is Legend Bowl. And what we have going on right now. All right, here we go, football nerds. This is Legend Bowl. This is an update, uh, one of the last updates uh, before launch, before console launch, I will put it out. And so I'm gonna go down here into my roster data and I'm going to load a roster that I have in here. It's called Pass Rush. I'm back out and then I'm gonna go to an exhibition game and I'm going to hit the roster sheets. So as you can see up in here, let me get my thing up here. Um, Brevard, he's a good QB. They got a good halfback. Um, if you look at the defensive ends over on the right side of the screen, I've actually got the defensive ends down in speed. And it's because there were some uh, mechanical adjustments that Havel made in the game to bring the players a little bit closer overall on the field to the same speed. Uh, but I'm going to hit the X button. I'm going to hit it twice. So I've got a choice between the metros and the walleyes. Now, if I bring this up on the roster sheet, you can see there uh, the walleyes have a really ridiculous defensive line. They've got a good OLB, good CB, and a good free safety. And then the offense, they've got a Hall of Fame QB. They've got a good tight end. Their halfbacks are just okay. That's the other thing I did in this roster is I bumped up the halfback speed a little bit. I think their floor is about 80. I think that's what I've got for most of my studio. The other one's 86 speed. And so I was hoping that by bringing up the speed, I could get uh, the same number of sacks, the same or equal number of sacks. I brought down the DE speed, and uh, hopefully that will allow us also to get better overall rushing stats when playing AI versus AI, like Watch Live and stuff like that. I don't know who I want to play with here. If I want to be the Metros, this is, by the way, is a, a roster. These are rosters that are rated for another classic teams mod, and then I just kind of tweaked them a little bit and put them in here with the base with the base teams and our regenerated names and stuff. So um, nothing looks like they're actually <laughs> very little like the rosters that I made before. I'm gonna go with the Minnesota Walleyes just because I really like their defense. And we're gonna see what's happening. I'm playing with the controller. And I'm playing on, oh, you know what, I gotta check my si second, let me check. Settings, difficulty, yeah, better. Okay, better and kicking is on Superstar. Okay, so we're gonna go with this. Resume game. Um, veteran really is probably a more balanced mode for this game overall. Superstar is pretty rough on the run game. And then Legend is just, I don't know, if you find life too easy and you want to find a way out, <laughs> I don't even know. Legend is tough. But yeah, that's uh, I'm just testing this out. As far as a user gameplay experience, <laughs> I get tired of that word experience being tossed around video games, but I just found myself doing it, so I guess I'm part of that crowd now. But as far as how the game feels, how it plays for uh, somebody who wants to use full control. These guys have a really good QB. And I'm just wondering... <laughs> and by the way, their QB, let me just show you. QB here is Corvin Fugate. Some of the names in this in this uh, new update are incredible. They added the guys in Discord that just packed it full of a bunch of names. So even when you randomly generate a roster, you get some really interesting... Orville Kauf, Lincoln Fellows, Chauncey Fisher, you know... Great names. Aiken Reynolds. That's a that's a, Dino Alsobrook. You know these are classic names. <laughs> Let's see what we got here. No, oh, cough gets loose. He beat the man coverage. And he is moving. No, you can't get him. No, you can't get. No. Oh, come on. All right. So you got a first down on that play. By the way, the out routes against man defense are delightful. Use them often. I'm gonna do slant stops on this one, and we're gonna see what we got. The thing with these with these slant uh, stop routes, those stop routes come back pretty far. So I don't know. Yeah, you're only gonna get about a yard on those routes because of how far back they come in. 
Um, I may adjust those for myself later on. One other thing I did, by the way, already. <laughs> yeah, I already did this because I don't know, I'm crazy or something. Uh, I already put some new plays in Flexbone. Flexbone had only, really only fullback runs in it. Um, they went back to that base on the playbook. They added a ton of new plays, but Flexbone was still fairly basic. So I put these screens in just because that way you can get your you can get the ball to the edges and it does help uh, it'll count as a screen pass but there we go so as you can see nice little five yard it's a run play really but there, it's going to count as a pass but yeah that's why i put those in here and then i go a sweep that's if you want a little longer developing play oh and it got bad so these plays aren't definitely are not overpowered so i can go for field goal here or i can go ah i'm gonna take the field goal and we got a field goal so we went down and scored some points on the first drive now as far as what uh, hollow did with this game it's very interesting he adjusted some under the hood mechanics to make the players all a little bit it's almost like a what would i call it I would compare it to like an audio limiter where everybody it just kind of compresses the range of speed that everybody has into a tighter band and so you know players that are at different speeds are not as separate so to speak you know a player that's at 67 won't be that much slower than a player who is 80. They'll still be slower, considerably slower, but not. it won't be such a noticeable, huge difference. And then meanwhile, um, he did a bunch of other stuff, like put new rosters in and stuff, so all the ratings are, are different, changed. It's just overall a very... It actually plays much tighter now, which is good. Even at uh, pro level, it plays a little tighter. It's still much easier than better, but um, it's, a, it's an interesting update. really adds, actually. I think the gameplay, the AI versus AI game, gameplay is just... It's night and day. Um, oh, there we go, guys. That's why I have that defensive line. Tope Dedrick. I mean, look at that. Tope Dedrick. Buy this game. This game has Tope Dedrick in it. Well, maybe the base game doesn't, but you can get him in there. You can get a bunch of... You can get better names than that. That's such a killer name. Oh, no. Cough is down. But, yeah, that's... Uh, that's what's going on here. This game has gone through a lot, and, you know, I think it's not really... Some people say this game is missing stuff, and there's no excuse for it just being one one-man dev team. I disagree. I think this game is impressive for what it is, and the fact that it was developed by one guy makes it even more amazing. That was a bad run play. These guys were stacked up and waiting for it. I should have audible, but I didn't. I don't want any of these right now because I want to spread them out. Exclude 19 3 corner. Uh, I like this for underneath zone stuff. If I see those linebackers pull back, I'm definitely getting my LP. Yep. Oof, got that. So, that's kind of, uh, that was one of those things that uh, some of these plays are based on is just how to get underneath zones and then how to beat those zone coverages. I'm going to try to run here, but these guys are stacked up. You can see how they're stacked up on top of me. That means they're they're manning up, so it'll be hard to find. I'm not going to find them in there. I'm going to go with this. Try to hit my Y underneath. Yep. Oh, he got hit as he caught it. That's too bad. Oh, and now I lost a guy. Oh, I lost my halfback. That's anti-good. Recovery two weeks. That's not, doesn't make me feel special. Um, let's go X speed over. Oh, this is man, so I've got a chance on the outside there. I do have a chance. Oh, that was not good. I need to hold that a little bit longer. Let that pass go at a tighter spiral. But uh, third and 10. Let's go with Shotgun Pro. And where, where are you? There you are, 7.56 flat. 
Oh, this is too nickel. Oh, come on! Hold on to that ball for me. Oh, that's a shame. Okay. I'm gonna punt. I'm gonna punt from the 50 on 4th and 10. Oh, and also, man, the punt logic on the AI is incredible now. They will try and call from the corner of your... They will try and call from the corner of your team every time. They get, you know, you'll get the ball. And they'll kick it out of bounds. So that It's not always you getting the ball on the 35 or whatever. But you, it's hard, man. It's hard, so I love that about it. There we go, guys. Clean that up for me, thank you. So yeah, Minnesota good defensive line. Not a great secondary, but they've got a couple good players up in the back. Broda. He's a 91 overall. I'm just gonna... Oh, nice sack. There we go. There we go. That's my boy. That's my big defensive tackle. Royce Haggard coming through. So, I'm gonna do Hawks Contain now. Yeah, I hope people get... I hope people buy this game. I hope this game catches on because the truth is it needs to. Um, this is a game that if you look at where it's come from and where it is now, it's clear that the developer, Havel, King Havel, Super Pixel Games, really wants it to be special and really wants to make something that uh, that is very football. And that's why he keeps doing this stuff because he's trying to make it, he's been trying to get more football under the game. Nice. And so that's why it's been so long. Uh, why it's why it's been working on it for so long. But it's pretty it's pretty impressive with where it's at now. So here I've got a chance to make some yards. We'll see what happens. And that center's gonna pull. And follow these guys out. So, oh, oh, I had some room. And I did not take advantage of it. I should have gone slightly more to the right. Let's go Ohio. Ohio. Got man coverage there. I'm probably gonna go. Yeah. There we go. But you can see how the defense gets. See, I mean, I caught that ball in space, but the defense comes right back and gets it. It feels very authentic in a lot of ways, and more authentic than a lot of games I've played in the football realm. Oh come on! Oh come on! Once again, you have it in your hands. You drop it. The 39, I can't kick a field goal from here. I do not trust my kicker. The second. Let me see that chart. Uh, he's got 87 strength. I might be able to make it, but no. 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 I'm going to go this way. And I'm probably going to lose this, but... But I just can't. There we go. Okay, so we'll be in. Let's go with this right here. Nope. Nope. That's okay though. Still up by three. And now delay fire too high. Let's see what happens up here. Good. Good, good, good. So, crossfire three. Oh, once again. So yeah, man, you want to good defense in this game. You want to have a good defense with you. Go cover seven. And I'm going to see what happens. Actually, I want to see what happens if I take my cornerback because he angles more to grab the interior. Oof. It actually did look like my safety was going over there trying to get the outside, so that's good. That's what I was testing there. Cover three match. So there's gonna roll left. Oh, you know what? I need to take that off. I didn't realize I was looking at that till just now. Settings, graphics, and show team plays off. That's one new thing there too. That was added. The plays are shown. You can actually, and that's really helpful for watch live games actually. If you're gonna do a watch live game, turn the show plays on so you know what's, what the uh, AI is picking. And that's really fun to see. It's really cool to see how you know plays win, how plays are positive yardage or negative yardage based on what defense is chosen where. 
nice defense guys man one thing I also did in this roster and this roster that I made for myself was I took down the skill level on the linebackers I had linebackers with a, the higher the skill the more you're gonna see linebackers intercepting the ball and that uh, gets kind of cheesy after a while so I took down I gave them plenty of speed and strength and then I took down their skill just to try to make them miss more passes and so far it seems to have done I wouldn't say it's done a D trick but it's done a trick <laughs> uh, it seems to have actually helped a little bit in that domain and I hope that holds true through you know more playthroughs more watch live games all, all of that good stuff because you never really know man nice nice defense once again guys way to get there way to get there now I'm gonna go 4 and 2 this is one of my favorite defenses if you've seen any of my games before you know this oh they got me man I, I thought they were, I actually thought we were gonna get a sack nope they just picked that blitz up and he hit that pass so now I gotta figure out I'm gonna have to go okay End of the first. And that's the other thing, man. You notice, like, um, the drives. The drives have gotten tighter. They've gotten sturdier. So it's not just, oh, come on, guys. Oh, good job. But, I mean, that's still... The drives have gotten longer. You know, there's more plays per drive now. And the time that, they, that each drive takes has also increased. So it does feel like a pretty... You know, it's a pretty good back and forth sometimes. So I love that. So I'm gonna try and... Oh, they got me. That was just a nice pass. Nice throw. Nice all of it. 11 plays, 60 yards, 2 minutes, 15 seconds. I love that drive. You know, I hate when it's run against me, but that's the kind of drive I like to see more often. I love the fact that it's not just a 3-4 all the time. Almost got that. Almost got that. I adjusted the uh, kicker's foot speed so that the faster interior guys would not get there so quickly. It does reduce their chances a bit of getting a field goal block. And I did that because even I wanted to make sure that my wanted to make sure that my increase in speed on the defensive lineman overall did not interfere with the kicker's ability to make a kick. But I still wanted sacks. Yes, good job, Stewart. Perry Stewart. So now I'm gonna run. I'm gonna run the inside split. I do like. Oh, oh, nope. <laughs> I just had it's not the. That is not my other running back. That guy's slower. What is Dykus? He's an 80. Well, that's disappointing. Um, so instead of that, let's go shotgun trips, actually. Slot replace. So this quarterback that I've got, as you can see, he's an 82 speed. He's fairly, he's fairly mobile. We're gonna go, yeah. Oh, if I had thrown that right, he'd be on the run right now. Minnesota 24, I got a punt. I've got to punt. There we go. So, that was a nice little punt. Maybe not as long as I'd like it, but long enough. I do not want that. I'll go dollar. No, I don't want dollar. I want. Four four two odd. I'm gonna try to be haggard this time, see if I can put any pressure on QB or run. Nope. Nice job. All right. Sanford McKesa. McKeska. To fire. What are you doing back there? Why do you look? Wow. All right. 
Man, these guys are burning me on the outside. But I think the metros, if I'm not mistaken, let me look at the depth chart real quick. I think these guys are actually, yeah, they're pretty fast. <laughs> the metros are pretty fast. So, I gotta watch my outsides a little bit more. I don't think I can leave my corners in man as much as I'd like to. Nice little return, man. 24 yards. Lincoln Fellows. Got a little blocking. Overall, this game is much smoother. And also, Havo fixed a memory leak. Um, oh, see, I hate this play against this defense. Yeah. You have a, you have a choice between blocking a corner or blocking the safety. It never works out. You need to have a clean edge here to be able to run that right. Let's go back to I-4. There we go. So yeah, um, there we go. So yeah, if you if you're running the tackle wrap out of shotgun trips, it can get kind of tough to run it correctly unless if they're in man and you're tight end, then you can get it. But ooh, five two no, I'd rather run this way. There we go. <laughs> Fourth down. Eh. I'm gonna go for it just because. Well, really, what choice do I have? You guys look like they're in man, which means. Oh, nope. Just not fast enough. I mean, that defense gets there fast. It actually, like. It feels like you're you're really playing a, a good defense. And I love that. I love that about this game. I love that about how it's coded. Um, oh, Havo did a bunch of stuff too with the AI running. The, sometimes in the past, um, the runners would take weird paths. They would not stay on their path. They would miss big holes <laughs> that they could have run through. Now, that still does happen. Um, I will just say, it's. Not, I wouldn't call it, I guess, completely resolved, but it's much, much, much better. Even in coach, you know, you can, I've played coach mode too in this already. You can have some pretty enjoyable games just calling plays. I had real trouble in the past enjoying coach mode because it just, you know, sometimes it was so aggravating to watch the runner try to run with the ball that I didn't even want to put up with the whole game. But uh, I can do, I can do a whole game now, and I can I can enjoy it. It's actually not bad. So that's a, that's a huge improvement right there. And then I picked the wrong play. I wonder if they did they get this. No, that was a long kick that they were trying. So the uh, they also he also improved the AI as far as when they kick. You know, it takes into account the kicker's strength. But the kickers can still make a bad kick and miss a field goal like that. They, they miss a move by a little more than I'd like to see sometimes, but nonetheless, it's not terrible. There we go. They, you see a lot more, um, like, 49, 50, 52 yarders kicked, and that's pretty cool. And, you know, some of the kickers in the game, it depends, really, a lot of it depends on your own roster ratings, too. If you've edited your roster, how many kicks they make is dependent on the strength you gave them. So... You know, in a lot of cases, I base my kickers on on uh, old stat lines. So my kickers are not, there are a number of kickers in this game that are not as talented as, as today's kickers, as modern kickers. So it adds kind of a more, uh, I would say, a different dynamic to the whole game as far as the accuracy and strength of kicking. They tried to blitz off the edge and I had my, <laughs> I had my running back right out there. Nice. Let's do full eye plunge now. No, oh, we're going 5 2. Okay, well, let's see what happens. Nope. Just not quite enough speed to get there. This guy just isn't fast enough. Oh, 
much of strong ice at this time. Th oh, see, it's third down. Well, I'm not going to do it now. Oh, come on, man. Thought I had him. I thought I fooled him. All right. So it's fourth and two. I'm going to go Eiffel. Power this time. Do I want to follow? Do I want to mesh? Bomb roll blue. Oh, two minute warning. Now it's time to start using my timeout. Look, what? Okay, well, yeah, I'm going to have to use a timeout here. Wait, what happened? What happened? I can't call a timeout. I just had to kick that, I couldn't call time. Oh, well if I actually tried a little bit harder, I might have been able to make it. <laughs> and that's a wonderful thing to realize. That's like a 50 yard or two. There we go. Alright. I don't know what happened to my... Oh! How come I can call a timeout now? I can't call a timeout during a kickoff? That's a bug. That's a bug and I have to report it. Just a second. Sorry, one second here. Just a second. Couldn't call a timeout during a kickoff. Alright, so let's go back now to the game. Oh, there we go. Royce Haggard once again. So now it's third and 17. And silver ride, let's do that. Probably should have gone with something a little more zony, but uh, didn't. Oh no. Oh no. You tried to run against me. <laughs> now I'll call a timeout. Fourth and 21. Pump return. Well, if I get this ball back in good enough field position, by any chance we win, looks like I might. Alright, 1 minute 21 seconds left, but I'm at midfield, so now I'm going to shift single edge back. to use my time out there but call it again nope those safeties man you they almost like they're going midfield but then they suddenly take off over the over to the sideline or um, deep half fool me it's pretty cool. Third and six. Didn't care about making the first down there, just wanted to get to where I could have a chance of making a fourth down play. Let's go count on any switch. Good, good. Still one minute remaining. Um, stick. Let's run this. 
Okay. Still got plenty of time, guys. Plenty of time. Nobody panic. Nobody panic. Seam rip. Let's see where they headed here. Get out of bounds. 43 seconds and a second and six. Um, yeah, Quattro snag. Got it. Got it. Yup. Just like that. So I'm going to go with the field goal. All right. Fourteen to ten. Things don't look nearly as dire now as it did just a few minutes ago. And I hope so far from what you've seen in gameplay, you can see that oh, that it's very balanced. The game is actually becoming it's actually become much more. Uh, Competitive, I guess, on one level, but then also uh, a bit smoother. You don't have guys just tearing in at like 90 miles an hour. Now, in some ways, I kind of miss that. This, oh wow! That was, wait a second. A second, let me see what. Who had the safety coming down? And everything. He just, he just caught between those guys. That was a nice pass and catch, man. That was. These guys get my score on me again. Just a second, let me do linebacker. Actually, let me. Let's take a look at that. I'm not sure if this. I'm not sure if this linebacker blitz play has much blitz in it. Good thing I was there. You guys are standing around. They're in field goal range now. Let's go free flat. Man. Yeah, a good QB in this game. He can he can make it tough. He can make it tough on you. He can make it tough on you. Oh, should I do cover? Yeah, I'm gonna cover seven here. Dwyer. Good. So they're gonna try to kick the field goal. Put themselves up by seven. Yeah, they have to time out. All right. Let's see. Come on, guys. Mm. Oh, did they miss it? They missed it. Yes. I think my big old defensive tackle, Haggard, coming through there, Royce Haggard. I think he, I think he intimidated them into missing that. Run this. Oh man, I had the gap. I had the gap. They just close that before it do anything. It's going to blast. Yeah, there we go. I was hoping I would have time for one more play, but it's okay. Poof, look at those rushing yards. Neither of us can run. Hey, bring him down next time, man. Great. Okay. Well, didn't get the 100% on that. That stinks. There we go. Good, good tackle. Way to take it out. And now we've got a tough three match. Oh man. I thought I was going to dislodge that ball. Oh, he did a good job hanging on because I hit him as he caught it. That was a good deep man. That was the right call for that play, too. That was the right call for that play. I think they're gonna run here. Yep. Got him. Got him again. Nine binding with rough for negative 19. He's having a rough day. He's having a rough day. Let's go cover too hard now. Oh, do I wanna do. Yeah, I wanna do hard. I wanna cover those flats. Oh, come on. 
I have my guy. It's alright though. It's alright. We're all a team. I'm trying. I'm trying, game. I wanna be smart. I wanna play smart. Demani Asp. Man, that's a great name too. Demani Asp? Yes! Great job to the guys who chose the names and put them all in there because uh, it adds something. In fact, it adds a great deal. <laughs> Just seeing crazy names sometimes pop up, that is, that is definitely something. So, I like that a lot. Um, do I want to do this? No, I want to do this. Let's do cover nine here. Yeah, okay. So, much as for one, I'm gonna get the punt. Get the ball back. Down by four. Oh, uh, just a little bit earlier, maybe I could have gotten that. A little quicker on the juke. Um, I'm just gonna run dive. Dive out of T4. Hmm. Don't like that look. I'm not gonna run dive. Run. Sweet. Oh man. These guys cannot hold a block. Just cannot hold a block. If I had maybe a little faster halfback, I'd be okay, but I do not have the depth I need. Nice job, Stuart. Way to run your route. Way to run your route. Just run. Curve underneath. Give me a chance to make a play. Bootleg pass. Huh. I wonder if I can do... Yeah... This instead. I can. Nice play. Nice. Man, they were all inside. Sweep them outside. Toss it. That was cool. I'm gonna run buck sweep again. Oof, this won't turn out well. Yeah. That dude got through there so fast. I should have of that. I could tell from the beginning that wasn't gonna go well. Um, let's go pistol and stick vertical. Yes, there it is. There it is. That's all I needed. Just enough to split those safeties apart. And I'm up by two. And I'm up by three. That was cool. So, I'm gonna kick to the left this time. I think I did that too far, didn't I? Oh, just out of bounds, man. I wanted to kick it on the sideline. All right, give them good field position. Go back to the 4-3 set. Oh, you know what? I might add a couple. Hmm. Four hundred two delay is gone. Oh man, I do. I do broke some tackles. Still four yards, but mm, brown even. Yeah, cover the tight end here. Oh man, he just threw me off him. I might have a chance to make that play, but I could not tap through that block. One thing about Legend Bowl 2, I think it would be cool to have, instead of just mashing A button and break a block, it would be good to have like a some kind of timing or maybe a sequence of movements to make, something like that, because just mashing an A button 
So I'm trying to cross that line. Uh oh, and we just hurt their QB. Ooh, that's no good. Sorry, man. We weren't trying to hurt you. So who's their QB now? Is, I wonder if he is he fast too? Hmm. Man, I wish he picked that off. It's third and twelve, so I want to do split three and vert two. Yeah. There we go. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, man. <laughs> I did not know that ball was going to be caught. Okay, let's punt return. <laughs> That's one thing, man. This game does keep you on your toes because stuff like that happens. And you don't really realize what's happening until, until somebody's already moving. Oh, see, they pinned me at the 10. See, that's the one thing, man. The game will now, it runs those uh, coffin corners on you. It tries to get the punch at the sideline for maximum uh, maximum distance and minimum return. And they do a good job. It's pretty cool. I love that. Dude, this game, man, seriously. Like, it's not a your traditional pixel art game. People compare it to Retro Bowl and Techno Bowl. It's another, you know, it's none of those. Uh, it's far more advanced than either one. Retro Bowl, um, <laughs> the comparisons to Retro Bowl crack me up because this game is not even in the slightest anything like Retro Bowl. That's my hurt <laughs> back out there. That's right, I need to not use but I need to not use that. You know, one thing that would be cool is if you have a player injured, like in a three halfback set, it would be cool to have the little red, the little red injury button on that formation, so that you know that hey, you're going to be playing with at least one guy injured, just because of the personnel in that formation. That would be a good thing to have, just so you don't forget. Oof. Finally, a positive run, but not enough for first down. Ah, I'm up by three. Should I go for it? <sighs> oh. <laughs> Should I tr See, if I run outside zone here, I'll have a chance, but not a great one. I don't expect to make this. Oh, did I? They're going to take that from me. I can already tell. They never want to give you where's the ball at i can't see the ball so it's just a just a quarter yard oh it's just short i knew it they never even though it looks like you crossed that line they never give it to you ah well i've given them a good chance to tie or score tie or take the lead no no not that time though Nah, that's a number four three again. And this time I'm trying to hit the outside. Man up on their running back. Oh, that didn't work at all, did it? I didn't have to do anything. I just let my massive defensive line take it over. Uh, let's go zone blitz here. Third and twelve. Yeah. <laughs> Got him again. Got him again. The outside linebacker this time. Nice job, guys. Just a second, you know what? I want to replay that because I want to see. Oh, he just ran right through his block. That's all. He had. Uh, he helped his defensive tackle out and together. They just took that down. Nice. Nice. But they still tied it up. That was a great play, though. Nice defensive stand, fellas. Yeah, he only got negative two yards on that drive. So, let's see. Oh, nope. Did what I could. 
so yeah, there's a, I mean, as you can see, this is, there's a ton of new plays in here. Um, so there's a lot of, honestly, there's just a lot about this game to like. This game has some things that I don't like. This game has some weird little flaws in it. Um, sometimes the blockers ahead of you on a sweep will turn around and come back towards you. That drives me, uh, honestly, drives me up the wall. But, you know, it's just one of those things that overall it doesn't diminish the game enough to make me not want to play it. So, I guess that's really my problem, not the game's problem. Um, you know, if I don't hate it enough to stop playing, then I guess it's not that big a deal. But it is something, there are, there are some blocking issues to clean up. And then of course there's no PA passes, there's no, there's all that stuff, but the reason that I'm so happy with this game, I do believe that all that stuff will eventually get put in. Yes, yes, that's my extremely talented tight end. What is that guy's rating? I don't know this dude. Yeah, 85 overall, 86 skill, that's why he catches those. He just, he just runs great routes, and when the ball gets near him, he catches it. That's what you want. Lee, yes, there's a lot of stuff in this game that could be better. But I'm also confident, highly confident, that it will be better. Because I've seen what, what it was when it first started, I've seen the potential it had, and I've seen it just slowly build towards reaching that potential. So that's why, you know, to me, I'm happy to play this game. I love it as it is. And I'm also sure that in the future it will get better. It'll only get better. I'm starting to get a little yardage now, man. Hey, I'm starting to starting to run a little bit. I haven't had a great deal of success running the football today, but just those little inside runs. Let's run Z Rita under. Yeah, so Z Rita, always my Z receiver on the outside there. He runs that little Rita, which means he comes to the comes from right to left and underneath. And I hit him right there. <laughs> So there's Lou and Rita. Lou is the one where your X comes from left comes from left to right underneath. I'm gonna run drag four tiger rail here. If I can hit my tight end, now uh, they're manned up on him. Uh, is it two man? Yeah. Oh man, to block that pass down. I should have run for that. I had room. I had room. No, not crow flats. Corner strike here. Oh yeah. Man. I thought I had a plan and I didn't. Well now I've gotta go for it. I've gotta try to kick this field goal. I thought I could run for it and I just could not. Oh did I get it? I got it. I got it. Yes, sir. 52 yards for Sergio Buckley. 52 yard field goal. I think that might be the longest I've ever kicked. I was dead on. Now, oh, why did I do that? How come I got it on the field goal, but I'm just kicking it out of bounds every time I get it? <laughs> okay. Well, cool. That's that's one way to live your life. <sighs> Man, but no, this is, I mean, obviously, this has been a really good game. Tight, really tight defense. Um, no, 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 until that, until, until you just decided. Ah, okay, well. Boy, I don't know. I was just talking about tight defense, and then nope, nope. They just went long. So now I'm down by four. Man. Let's see if I can, let's see if I can do this. Oh boy. So right at the 20. I've got to do, should I do shotgun throw? I love drag four tiger rail. I love this play and I don't know why. Yeah, the outside beam. No, man. I don't know what I did there. I don't know why I did that. But I did it. 
Some double wins. Hmm. There we go. So that makes a third manageable. Should I try the sweep? Uh, this will depend on what they come out in. I've got a chance here, but not a great one. Huh. Let me try it. There we go. See? And here's where, as I was saying, sometimes the, the guys will turn around. I almost got... <laughs> I almost got... wrecked by my own guy there. Boink. But I managed to get around him. So I got the first down, so that's cool. 73 yards rushing for him. Didn't seem like it was that much, honestly. I had no idea I had that much rushing yards. <laughs> Alright, I'm trying to run down time and move the ball because I don't want them to have a bunch of time when they get, if they get the ball back. If I score... Nice! Nice little run, man! Man, that was blocking. And that's the other thing, man. Sometimes for all, when there's an issue with the blocking, then suddenly you'll come back around and they'll just make an awesome, awesome little play. That's such great inside zone blocking right there. Look at that. Look at these guys getting their man and they're moving up the field. That, that's why it's just, you know, you, you, I can't quit this game. It's too good. Are they going to go man again? Because if they do, I'm going to hit this slant. Yep, they're going man again. RP. No! Oh. <laughs> I missed that and it still worked. That's messed up. I could have just went by my outside guy there to get that. Thank you, fellas. You are a gem. You, sir, are a gem. Uh, and they're going man again? Good. Hit that 10 yard out. Hit that 10 yard out. Uh, we'll run Z streak. Oof. Good coverage by the safety. I was actually trying to just, I should have held on a little bit longer to get a little bit more of a lower angle on that ball and might have had a chance, but it floated. I floated it. Now that one. That one was nice. That was nice. I like that. Let's do three minutes. I wonder if I should just let the clock drain, man. Yeah, I'm going to let the clock run down a little bit. Probably gonna try and hit B here, depending on what those linebackers do. Yep. Yep. All right. Now the question is, do I go for two? And I do. I'm gonna go for two because then they have to get a TD. And I'm going to win or lose the game right here, basically. What? Okay. I don't know what that was about. Was, well, I can't see what my charge thing was at, but I had B, which was who I was trying to throw it to wide open. So, <laughs> as I said, win or lose the game right there, right? Now they can come down. And they can win with a field goal. They've got two minutes, second, two minutes, eleven seconds in all three timeouts. Plenty of time. Plenty of time. And I have nobody to blame but myself. All right, keep them in balance. Keep them in balance. Make them use their timeouts. Yep. That's two minute warning. Now we'll have to start using timeouts if I can hold them. If I can hold them. 
Ah, uh, no, you know what? Yeah, two man. <laughs> wow. <laughs> they hadn't been able to run on me all game. And so maybe they break that one off. 21 yards. I think that guy actually got in a positive rush yard with just that one. <laughs> just that one run. That's incredible. Nice. Dwyer! Dwyer! He seals it! He seals it. Sergio Dwyer, my inside linebacker. Time for me to run the clock out. What a finish. I mean, well, shouldn't count by Weasel's. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That'll teach me to count my Weasel's before they've popped. That, uh, that guy came through there in a hurry. So. Let's see. Actually, you know what? I'm going to flex bone. Let's run the C sweep screen. Oof, 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 oof. Six yards, man, that was my injured halfback too. Let's run this time. Let's run wing seam settle. Let's run settle here. See what happens. Nice. Nice. I bet now they have to use a timeout, don't they? No. They're not gonna? I'm gonna let it run down then. Sorry. So anyway, this game, awesome. Um, there's a depth to the gameplay and a fun to the gameplay. Even the, a lot of people complain about the passing bar. Honestly, I think it's just awesome. I think the passing bar is awesome because you can you can choose to feather your pass. You can float it. It's not just like it's not like Madden where you kind of tap B or hold hold B. It's like you have to actually time it and understand the timing of the routes of your receivers. It's really cool that way. So I think it adds a lot to the game. That nice. Once again, just the, I treat those like run plays. They're screen passes but I treat them like runs because that's really how they operate. Um, and you know, in, in a flex bone offense, you're trying to get your ball to the wing backs usually on the option pass, but not in this one. This this doesn't have options. Nonetheless, not in the this. Nonetheless, you can still do a lot with the wings if you use those screen passes. So that's why I put them in my playbook. They're actually on the Discord too in, in plays if you want them, but um, yeah. I, you can do so much with this game, it's awesome. That is it. Yup. 39. So I'm just going to let the time expire. And I'm going to take my win. And go home. And that will do it, man. We just beat the New York Metros. I want to check out the stats. So 19 first downs. They're 11. 468 total yards. 400 passing. They had three rushing. They actually did get into positive yardage. So 260 passing, nine per attempt. And I had 68, four yards of carry. And I ran, man, I ran 73 plays to their <laughs> 48. One turnover in the whole game. <laughs> I had the ball nearly double their time. That's awesome. That's awesome. Player of the game. And Selmo Donahue, yeah, that dude, that dude was a problem. Three TDs, 32 yards per catch. That guy, he was rough on me. Uh, this is the player stats here. If you get, hey, can't complain about that though. 119, 75% completion, 400 yards, three TDs. Oh, uh, wait a minute. Who's, oh, they had two, 115 for their, for McKiska. And he had two TDs, no picks. And then Holaba had a pick. 
Man, so if this guy had stayed in the game, who knows if I would have won? Because he was really good. Man, five yards for Nikes. Even with, despite all the problems I had, that was, that's really cool. And they had... Whew, that's a rough stat line right there. I have really good run defense, I guess. Um, man, it's the yards. It was cough. The yardage, seven, seven, six, five. Man, these guys... These guys had a day. And then three T's for this guy who's just a monster. Huh. Alright. They have one sack. And I had three. Four sacks in this game. That's really good. And one was by an OLB, RDT, and CB. That's when he got chased from the pocket. So, that's a pretty cool game overall. That is a pretty cool game. Luckily, I missed one field goal. That, one, that was a dumb one. And then what about them? They missed two. That's where they lost, right there. That could have been the game for them. You know. Alright, so yeah. Hey man, it's Legend Bowl. The new update is outstanding. The names alone are worth, like, it's worth a paid upgrade just for the names. <laughs> but, but unfortunately, that, that wasn't, uh, Havo didn't want to charge for it. But overall, I think this game is really great, and it's gotten better. And I think this is one of the last few updates Hubble has said for the game. It's going to go to console soon. I hope people support it on console, because this game, when it gets another version, if if Hubble can justify doing another one because he gets a, you know, it justifies the time and energy and money, his own money that he spent on making it, this game could be a serious player game for football. A serious football game. And trust me, he wants to put more stuff in the game. He wants to do more uh, with the plays. He wants to do more with penalties. He wants. There's so much stuff that he wants to do that he just needs to know that it's going to be worth his time to do it. That he'll actually make enough money to support his family on it. And uh, if we, if people make that happen, this game is going to be an absolute monster. Uh, Legend Bowl 2, when it comes out, will be probably another 80% bigger at least is what I would guess probably as big as this game is and it's pretty big I would guess Legend Bowl 2 would probably be about 80% bigger at the minimum so check it out it's on Steam for sale right now and it'll be hitting consoles soon if you're someone who's already who just already has a game and would just like to watch it hope you enjoyed this one all right take care